So the second great tip is adding scarcity. Now we've all been subjected to this kind of stuff. Uh, well, we actually continuously subject to this kind of stuff. Whenever we go to the mall, to the shops, whatever it is, uh, there's always a 50% off or a while stocks last or get it now type thing where, you know, you're essentially being put under pressure, whether you like it or not, to buy this thing because it might go up in price. You never know. You need to get that deal today. And it's that's all about scarcity. Yeah, it might not be around for very long at this current price or at all. And we can apply exactly the same classic sales pressure technique with our uh, site. So let's dive over to one of the products and have a look at it. Okay, so I've come straight to my heart-shaped dog pendant and I'm just gonna put it in a little phrase here underneath the description. So I've added only 50 left at this discounted price. And I might wanna make it bold and perhaps make it a different color like red. But I don't want to overdo it. You know, I don't want that to be the only thing, you know, right in the customer's face. It's kind of like a, a, a cry for help. Please buy, please buy. You don't want that. You want something reasonably subtle, but at the same time, you don't want to miss it. Now, I've gone with a sort of only 50 left. So that's basically putting a scarcity on the number. But you can also do things with time. You can say things like, you know, sale ends in 24 hours, that kind of stuff. So if you're struggling for ideas, just literally think about the things that you see in the mall or in the store. Maybe go out, wander around. You're guaranteed to see some of those phrases. Now, one thing I want to say is that don't just leave this on here permanently, OK, because people will revisit your store. And if they constantly see the same messages, they are potentially going to lose a little bit of trust in your site. And that's definitely not what you want. So there we go, a very, very simple way of introducing scarcity to your products and putting a little bit of pressure on your potential customer to buy. Now later on, we'll look at some apps that can do this in a far more clever, far more fancier way and perhaps better presentation. But ultimately, it's still gonna be the same message. So I wanted to introduce to you at this stage of the course, a very simple way of doing it. So have fun with that, add some phrases and see how it affects your sales.